Yeah, so correlation we have like what is correlation and nothing but correlation can be used to capture the dynamic values which are generated from the server side. Correlation we can do for the two ways manual correlation and auto correlation. Manual correlation, nothing but manually we can do for the correlation. Auto correlation means automatically it will handle the tool that is the auto correlation. So in manual correlation, we have the process like find the dynamic value in our script and find the dynamic value LB and RB and where to write the function and substitution. Using these four points, we can do for the our like correlation. So first point, find the dynamic value in our script means uh, how to we can find the dynamic value. So we can record the script uh, twice and do different kind of test data, enter the different kinds of test data. Compare the text. And compare using for the text compare.com, like uh, text compare.com. Then we need to find the dynamic value. Like, so user section, departure, area, this all will be, we have find, right? So we'll go to the again already. So this is the, this is the two scripts. I recorded two scripts with a different type of text data. So this is the one script and this is the one script. For here, two scripts I am comparing. Once we can compare here, we are able to see for the like difference like this for the script to script. So here we can see start transaction and uh, this, uh, right? This, what is the difference it's showing? It is indicating from the highlighted, right? That is a uh, start transaction this we are giving manually. So that is not a dynamic value. So going to the vector, this value, right? It is not, there is no changes. And come to the again, uh, okay, come down. And uh, this is the login part. You have the user section will be there. Actually, this user section value, it is changed, but already we did for the correlation. That is why here it is not showing for the any difference. So, but this user section value, token value, some J section ID, this kind of will be generated from the login side. So these values we can consider as a server side values user section or token value or J section ID, this kind of values we can consider as a dynamic value Sorry. in server side. Sorry. So Sorry. now we are identified that one value is a user section value. You can note in the notepad user section value. And after that, uh, we need to go to the next step. And you can observe here, Jojo, here is the password also it's changing. But we are entering for the through keyboard. So we need to do for the parameterization. And after that, you can observe here values will be there. Values also it is 60 here will be different. But this yeah. is the XY coordinators. Those are not a dynamic values. Okay. And coming to the next. Uh, so here search flight, we don't have any values. And uh, coming to the next will be find flight. You can observe in find flight, we have the different cities we have. Uh, like this here is a Paris will be there. So going to the application, by seeing application, you can understand easy way for what are the correlation values also. So you're entering for the username and password. So and click on this and click on flights. Here you are selecting for the departure city, Denver to some London. So I am going to the Denver to London. Everyone is coming with me. No, right? No, no. User so to means user, user to user, the departure city, area city is changing. So these all will be application side dynamic values. Yeah. Okay. So and after that departure data, return date, that is the date and time parameterization. We need to do for the date and time parameterization. And seating preferences we are entering. So we need to do for the parameterization. And here you can observe seating preferences. We need for the window seat, or results or more none. You need to select for as a user. Maybe someone will be interested for the window. Someone will be not interested window. So means this is also user to user changing, application right? Side, uh, so appl application side dynamic value and type of seat also you can observe. We have the first business coach will be there. So depends on the your budget, you can select for the if you want to go for the first or business or coach, you can select for that. Means as a user to user, it will changing or not. Yes. So. Now we identify the what are the values departure city, error city, and seat preferences, seat type. 
So uh, already I written here. You can observe. First one is user section value. That is the server side value. Departure and array and this city. Uh, city type and C type and city preferences. So and uh, we have after that click on continue. These all will be flight values. So we have the different flights. Maybe I am going with the like blue sky air 020 is a flight. That is the it's fly in the departure time will be 8 a.m. Okay. and that will be cost will be 338 dollars. So my time availability that is fine. I'm going that is so everyone will coming with me. No, right? Mm -hmm. So they yeah. are uh, their preferences, like their time dependency, their cost dependency, they will go for the different flight. So that is means this value also it is a, as a user to user is changing. That's right. So that is why this uh, flight value also we can do for the correlation and after that payment details. So this all details we need to enter manually. So means what we can do, we need to do for the parameterization. parameterization. And uh, so after that click on continue, and then sign up. Now we are identify the all values. What are the values identified? User section value and departure and array, outbound flight and seat type and seat preference. So means these are all values you need to do for the correlation. Sunny, you are, you are able to understand? Yeah. Yeah. So now already I did for the user section correlation. Okay. And uh, next will be we can do what is the value? Departure. Yeah, that's city. Departure. So departure city. What is the value? London. London. So how to we can do the correlation means you can copy the dynamic value. Okay. And go to the output window and go to the code generation and come to the control home. Okay. And here in the search box, you need to paste that dynamic value. Click on find next. Okay. And this. Yeah, this is ours. Okay. Yeah. So now this is the our dynamic value. So you can copy the dynamic value, entire value. Okay. And copy and go to the paste from here. Okay. Paste it here. So this is the in this value. What is the dynamic London. value? London. London. So this is the London. If you consider this is the London is the dynamic value, right? Yeah. Maybe you have this is also will be there. Means we have the two chance will be there. Maybe if you choose is a, this is the dynamic value, your left boundary. So this is the left boundary. And the right boundary means this is the right boundary. Maybe if you choose this is the my dynamic value, this is the left boundary and this is the entire value will be right border. So now we'll see that one by one. So first we'll consider as a first one. This is the my dynamic value. Dynamic value left text we can consider as a left border. You can copy this and uh, give it as a LB. LB nothing but left boundary A equal. You can control B. And after that RB. RB nothing but right boundary is equal. What is the right boundary? Up to this yeah, is the right boundary. You can paste it. Now, we what is the our find the dynamic value completed? Find the dynamic value LBRB is completed. Where to write the function? Next point. So, where to write the function means we need to write for the one function. What is the function? Oh, Web underscore, underscore array underscore save yeah. underscore param. Okay, one minute.
yeah sorry so what is the function we break save param and we need to give for the uh, like parameter name comma lb comma rb comma last each argument we need to give with the double colon and semicolon okay so here what is the first column name parameter name which value we are doing departure Depart city. city Depart city underscore you are doing correlation you can give us a correlation next what is that lb lb nothing but already we know the lb for here any double colon will be there yeah, so, black slash. yeah if it is a double colon will be there in lb rb we need to give it, give it the black slash so and rb also you have one more double colon you can give it as a slash and now you can copy this entire value and paste in the double colon as a lb and rb also you can copy and paste it as a in double colon place in rb okay now where to write the function so where to write the function it is a very easy concept okay so this london is a snapshot t4 will be there so we need to write for the t3 above don't write for the immediately of the t4 we need to write for the t3 above so where is the t3 right, uh, exact uh, y above after one snap then is this yeah actually yeah. it is a response will be there in this place but if you writing here yeah. response not there your script will be fail okay okay the particular response, response server said, ah, okay. yeah it will be there here okay now you can copy this value so we need to write the function okay and you can replace with the uh, i think this is parameter name this is wrong this is wrong yeah this departs with okay now we need to replace with that so you can control c and we have the where is the denver you can replace with the you can remove the denver and open curly base and parameter name and close this. So we need to replace like this and just we can execute for the one time. Okay, so now your script will be passed. Now we need to check the our script pass or fail in the output window. We can check uh, what is the value we done. We are able to got or not. We can check here. So you can observe departure city frank rate can. So why? Because you yes, are doing for the way. like we are yeah. selected London, but it came frank end because yeah, that yeah, is yeah, the yeah. dynamic way. Yeah. So this is the way we can do for the correlation. So everyone able to write. Yeah, yeah. So I now but it's not changed. Just it changed like it's your city is changed. But I have done uh, for this uh, depart city. I have done correlation. Okay. I have checked in the output also, but uh, it's uh, shown Denver only. Okay, that will be you can give for the proper uh, boundaries. Okay, then you will okay, get. Okay. 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 So now, so this is the function, right? We have the different arguments also will be there. For this drop down, we have the many values will be there, right? In our application, if you log in and uh, enter bin and uh, can see here in the departure city how many values will be there but i want to display for the all the values in our script so how to we can display means we have one more argument will be there so we need to write for the year in the double colon and comma and we need to give for the ordinal is equal to all so ordinal ordinal nothing but it will ordinal stand for the occurrence of the dynamic value so you have the how many occurrences in your script all values it will be displayed in the your okay. okay. 
so you have how many alice you have so you need to give for the if you want all means you can give for the all maybe you want particular occurrence i want for the third occurrence then ordinal is equal three you can give uh, so depends on the which argument you want uh, like uh, you need to give for that okay and uh, occurrence. yes number of occurrences so if you execute this then you are guys able to understand okay So your script will be passed and go to the output window and we'll see the uh, like all values displayed or not you can see. So you can observe yeah. departure city underscore one first occurrence second occurrence how many occurrences you have all occurrences it will be generated when you are given ordinal got all it became an array and display for the all the occurrence and count also it will display. So you can observe departure city count will yeah, be 18. 18. So that is the ordinal. So is again, is an ordinal is an argument. Ah, uh, yes, it's argument. It depends on the your okay. recommend. For example, now if your recommend will be particular city you want to pick you can give for the ordinal is equal to 12 and what is the 12 last angel so if Last you give angel, for yeah. here 12 and you can observe output window yeah, last yes see, last angels yeah. so miss Depends on the your requirement, you need to give for the, like this. Okay. So every time we can't use, but depends on the your requirement, you can, if you want for the all occurrences, means you can give for the ordinary scholar. If you want for this, means you can give this. And one more thing, uh, for example, I give in Los Angel, right? In Los Angel, I don't want for the angels, I want for the first three characters, L O S. Okay. So that is the our requirement. So how we'll get means we have one more argument will be there. So we need to write for the each argument will be in the double colon only. Okay. And after, okay, last before. yeah so argument will be in the double colon and comma we need to give for the same length how many characters we want to capture first yeah, three characters, three characters. Yeah. so how many characters you want to capture you need to give for the save length is equal to three and just you can save this and again run So now we'll, uh, I think we are not executed. Yeah. So now you can observe the output window. LOS. LOS, you got it. Means how many characters you want, you can get, that is fine. But I don't but want for the LOS, I want argument. for the NJs, yes. Okay. That is the save length is a one argument. Save length nothing but it is specify the how many character you supposed to capture. Okay. okay. So uh, same to the we have one more argument, save offset. Because I don't want for the first three characters, I want for the last 
characters like los angels or it will be there right i want oh. that so in this case which argument we can use means we have the same offset will be there what is that same offset, offset. save offset to what is the save offset nothing but it is specify the how many character you supposed to skip Say offset nothing but how many character you supposed to skip for. So for example, in the last angels, how many you have? One, two, three, one, two, three, four, last six, angel seven. will be three characters. Actually, you yeah, want three. to capture how many characters? Last three characters. Okay, three characters. So no, no, yeah, you are you are skipping from the LOS, means yeah. three character you want to skip. So we need to write for the argument. Save okay, in the offset. double colon, save offset. Equal to three characters. What is the three character I want to skip? Three, uh, like loss. And I uh, assume to, if you have any gap in the between loss angels, so that is also you need to include. I think uh, two gaps will be there. So that is why I'm... Uh, skipping three and capturing for the three. Three nothing but uh, last four characters. Last angels. Angels is a five, four character, right? Four or five? Yes, yes. Five, five. Five. You can give five. And you can save this and run. So now we'll go to the above and we'll see here yeah in yeah, angel ray so maybe it's a, yes, only yeah, one single six, six. character will be there yeah yeah so we need to give for the single character only then you need to give for the four only here because how many character we are skipping los and as to the one space will be one there gap. Yeah. okay four then you will get for the angels Yes, space also we should have considered one. Yes, yes. Space also. If you have space, you need to consider it. That is also one character. Okay. If not, you will get for the uh, how we we'll got last time, right? You will get like this. So now we can go here. Engine. Yeah, Scheme, engine. right? So, yeah. so that is the way as per your requirement, you can use. Sometimes you can observe when we are applying for the government jobs or somewhere, right? So India in place, I end it will come. Yeah. So in this situation, you need to use uh, from the this kind of things. Means, name, that so. is the your requirement. Yeah. For example, APS RTC yeah. will be there. So sometimes so uh, Hyderabad, if you enter for the HYD, it is fine. Yeah. So this kind of requirement you can use for that uh, way. Okay, got it? Okay, got it. Yeah. So we have the many arguments will be there. Okay. So this is the main arguments. And we have the one more argument will be there. What is that means? Not found. Not found is equal to warning. Because when you are doing for the scripting, LBRB you are given. By mistake, you are unable to uh, like uh, LBRB you are getting for the no match found error. Some error you are getting every time. So, but in your script, you have the 100 uh, dynamic values, different values will be there. If you stuck here, your manager told us that today you need to complete this script. If you stuck here only, again, 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 you are checking for the like, oh, I'm getting error, I'm getting error, you are checking again and again. Then what will happen? Your time is waste. End of the day, your manager is lost. Your script is completed. Okay. What is your answer? No, right? No, no. So, means if you try for the two, three times, that fine. Then after that, we have the one argument will be there. That is the, uh, like, what is that argument means? Not found. Each argument we need to give for the, in double colon. Not found is equal to war. One name. Then that we so this then we if you it. give for the like uh, for example you are not given for the some uh, value miss or something is also miss right miss it will not throw an error but it is throw an a warning and your script will be false. Okay. 
సేవ్ సేవ్ యా ఇట్ ఇస్ ఆటోమేటిక్ రిస్టైన్ ఆ స్క్రిప్ట్ ఇస్ పాస్ యా యువర్ స్క్రిప్ట్ విల్ బి పాస్ బట్ యు కెన్ అబ్జర్వ్ ఐ థింక్ ఇట్ షో ఇస్ అ త్రూ అండ్ వార్నింగ్ yeah you can see here yeah been been throwing been, as uh, warning means this is a unit uh, handle but not now but because you don't waste your time yes we have lot of values in the down so you need to complete that is fine right yeah yeah fine clear yeah that is the one argument and uh, we have the one more argument is a rel frame id okay one more argument is the so rel frame id id so what is the rel frame id nothing but like it is a, some optimization technique so for example we have the 1.0 is a 1 in that 1.0 we have 1.1.0 or 1.1 and after that 1.1 1.2 will be there means this is the frame in the 1.0 these all the frames and as simple as we have the 2.0 will be there in the response maybe 2.1 and 2.2 like this will be there if you want to capture this particular frame then you need to give for the rel frame is equal to 1.1.2 means your response will be there in this frame you need to give for the like this that is the rel frame id so it depends on the your requirement you can use for the this got it yeah and we have the one more argument search search is equal to we have the two things will be there body other header means what is the response you are capturing dynamic value this value departure city or capturing right if you not given search here by default is pick for the body by default it will pick for the body but if you are this response contain in the header part you need to give for the search is equal to header it's clear yeah yeah search is equal to yeah. lb is equal to header okay yes yeah, no search is a one of the argument that is also okay 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 rel frame id is one argument search also one of okay. the argument we have the one more argument convert convert what is the convert nothing but so we have the some html text will be there and url text will be there if you want convert to html to url url to html means we need to give for the url convert is equal to html to html to url you can give for like this okay so to url then what will happen means your text will be convert from the html to url maybe you want to convert from the url to html then you can give it as a convert is equal to url to html so this is also one of the argument then once explain this search argument one second one second which one search one search is possible yes yeah, search okay okay i will go to here and you can observe for here uh one will take so for here we are doing for the some different value will try and we how any other values will be there pending okay c type yeah we have the c type will be there every city also will be there right yeah yeah for this value where it could be there how will be no means you can call like uh, just a rip here you can re, uh, put the cursor and show snapshot view and go to the above and after that we can see the request and response yeah. okay request and response for here your response like uh, what is the your response some paris will be there right? for example seat preference also you can observe here will be there so here where it is will be there in the request body will request be there body. and the response body also you are able to see means this counter response contain in the response body 
So that is why you need to give for the search is equal to body. If you give also no problem, that is default it will pick. Maybe this response contain in the header in this place, you need to specify the like search is equal to header. Then only it will, your script will be particular response will be pick. Okay. Got it? Yeah, yeah. So that is the arguments. So anyone, anyone have any doubt, uh, Sunny? I think Sunny is left. Oh, he left, huh? Yeah. Okay. No, okay, okay. No worry. I think you have, you are good, right? Yeah, okay. Once, once yeah, you, you can explain practice. about... Yeah, you okay, can okay. practice and you, I, you will be able to understand and, uh, okay, and we'll discuss more about uh, correlation because in this class okay. only I will take for the minimum two, three, uh, like uh, five classes more than because it's an important class. Every day I'm explaining for the how to we are doing for the correlation because yeah. every day I'm telling then you are keeping your mind and you are going to practice also doing good. Okay. 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 okay thank you. After correlation, we have to do classes. Yes, on this one. Yeah. Points. The arguments also we can practice. Okay. Okay. okay? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank Bye. You.